in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use, cause you can't stop it from shining. Well, it's spot updates on the news with me, Francis Bernard. In this edition, we are going to find out about the man who qualified Sierra Leone to the nation's cup after waiting for 25 years. This man is John Edward Kista. Let's find out a little bit about who John Kista is. Last 15 minutes, open you up a little bit more, open you up now, a bit more space, a bit more width. This is John Kista, the man behind this celebration. Born in the 70s, John is a former footballer who started playing football at an early age. He was inspired by his father, John Kista Sr., who also played football to national level. I think everyone that knows me now, you know, that's why I'm very everywhere. Everyone that knows me has known me from when I was very young. Whether I played at junior level, whether I was, this is all everybody knew me about before I even went back to you know, my two brothers. So we're known for football, football. So I've always been known for that. You know, f uh, you know, it's it's amazing how the the people that really know me when I was growing up. You know, I had this nickname when I was in school. You know, boys school they used to call me Kochi because I was all about football. Being the youngest of three boys, John attended different schools in both the south and northern part of Sierra Leone, including the boys school. His best moments as a football coach was when he won the Sierra Leone Premier League on beating with Eastern Lions Football Club and referred to the rancor he had with Madam Aisha Johansson as his worst moment. It's not even qualifying Sierra Leone. It's when we won the league at Eastern Lions, the challenges that I faced. The worst moment in my life was when I had a, when I had a situation with Madam, Madam, Madam Aisha and knowing where we'd come from and knowing where we started. John played football for various clubs, including Walsall and many other clubs in England. Although born in Manchester, the central midfielder made his debut for Sierra Leone in 1997, playing in two World Cup qualifiers against Nigeria and Morocco. Since then, he had 16 caps for the national team, Leon Stars. But what kind of person is John Kista? His assistant coach, Amidu Karim, was one of those players who played with him during his playing days as a footballer. I played with John in the national team and I worked with him in different categories, the home base, senior national team. And John is a, somebody that's very hard working somebody and he loves his job. And the most important thing about him I think, is discipline. Many perceive John Kista as an unassuming, disciplined and dedicated coach. And since he came back to Sierra Leone, more than a decade now, has developed many talents, including some players in the national team. Yemi Dunia is one player who went through the tutelage of John Kista, beginning from his days at FC Johansson. He made me the type of player I was playing when I was very young, very disciplined. He, however, spends time with his family and do engage in other social activities. Married with three kids, John is a lovely and caring husband, according to his wife. John Kista is a kind and loving man. He's a man of integrity, discipline, hardworking, and he has a huge sense of resilience. Joan also believed her husband is being loved by the people of Sierra Leone because of his results-oriented mentality. I'm coping well with his fans also. You know, most times when we go out, I see people, people love him, you know, they love him and I'm happy that he's loved by people. Joining Eastern Lions Football Club in the 2018-2019 Premier League season from FC Johansson, he won the Premier League on beating. Many believed that his appointment as head coach for the national team, Leon Stars, was a good decision by the authorities. Mohamed Benson Bawo, a football administrator at the FA, believes John possesses all the qualities needed for the job. John is an embodiment of the beautiful game. John Kista is one particular person whose work ethic and love for what he does should be replicated by any other person in this discipline. The former midfielder 
has served as a coach in different national teams, including supporting other coaches in different roles. He worked with John McKinstry, former Rwandan and Ghana coach Selah Stete, as assistant coach. John is a licensed A holder with a lot of experience in the coaching field. Kista took over the leadership of the Leon Stars in 2017 but was suspended shortly after a strained relationship with the FA. He was however reappointed in 2020 as head coach of Leon Stars on a deal until 2023. The 7 million plus Sierra Leoneans now look up to this man to change the football story of Sierra Leone. For SLBC News, Francis Bernard in Freetown. Well, with that, we bring the cutting down for sports updates on the news. Thanks for watching and keep watching DSLVC. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use. Cause you can't stop it from shining